Tractor Tales this week, Texas to Texas, to catch up with Clarence Lee, a man who says he's a fourth cousin to General Robert E. Lee. Clarence is also a collector who introduces us to the Nellie Bell. This is a 1939 Ford, 9 in. The serial number is 930, so it was made within the first three weeks of production. Did all the work myself and restored it, and it's mine to keep. He'd have to steal it to get it from me. I drove another tractor for a friend of mine on a parade. I went home and told her, I said, well, I, would, I sure like enjoyed that. She says, why don't you get you one? <laughs> In two weeks' time, I'd found this. That's what got me into it. I use it only for carrying uh, old folks at the nursing home on parades, having a little hay ride. I've been doing that for about, since I've had the tractor, about five or six years. I purchased her in uh, April of 201, and they were having a parade in Parrish, Texas. And they asked me if I could get it ready to go. I said, I don't know. So I had sleep out there. I couldn't sleep. So when I couldn't sleep, I'd go out to my shop and work on this thing. And I got it from April the 15th to July the 3rd, taking it all off hood and everything off, straightened it out, and I got it ready, painted on July the 3rd, and carried it to that parade on July 4th. Did you say this is one of your favorites? Well, I suppose so, because I got so many bells and whistles on it, and uh, I use it more than I do anything else. This tractor became known as the Ford Tractor with the Ferguson system because it was equipped with Ferguson hydraulics. They were sold for $585 back in 1939.